This is how you heal a home. I'm Terry. I'm an intuitive designer, a house healer, and a holistic interior designer. After my video on dousing a floor plan for geopathic stress, people are wanting to know how I actually do the healing. So that's what I'm going to show you today. So this is the floor plan that I had done. I've done a full um, report on this home since then, but in that video, and it's called dousing for geopathic stress, dousing a floor plan for geopathic stress, if you want to check that out. Uh, in that video, I doused for underground water and detrimental earth energy. It, also, the water is detrimental. That's only, I only look for things that are detrimental. So I found those lines running below this home. And now I'm going to show you how to clear them. So I normally would go through and do all the water, all of the earth and do things in sections, but I just want to show you today how I clear the water, how I clear the earth. They are quite similar. It's also something that when I do it, I don't say it out loud. So um, I will give you the full experience of me actually clearing and you'll see what I do there. So to start that off, you start with a prayer to begin. You're also going to be in a meditative state. Just clear your mind as much as possible, and then you can get started. Start with the Lord's Prayer and move on to my mantra, to the highest of the high and Mother Earth. Please combine and use me today as your healing instrument here on Earth. I ask that my healings of the highest standard, working for the higher good of people and animals. I would like to list the help of six archangels, Raphael, Michael, Gabriel, Samuel, Azrael, and Varel. All the archangels and angels that need to be here, my spirit guides, spirits, protectors, and healing guides. Now I'm ready to do the healing. Start with the water line, visualizing it being flooded with light and love. I see a bright white light flowing through the line. I ask for peace, balance, and harmony. I ask the highest of the high that the water vein be moved from underneath the house, moves to somewhere more appropriate, and leaves the stream in peace, balance, and harmony for all things for all time. Visualize a glowing light flowing through the earth energy, spreading across the entire planet. Ask that the line be left in peace, balance, and harmony for all living things for all time. I stay on each line as long as I feel it is necessary for the healing to take place. Um, the next step and the final step is closing down. To the highest of the high mother earth and her life-giving son thank you for using me as your healing instrument here on the planet i would ask that any doors that are expectedly or unexpectedly open during my work be firmly closed i'd like to thank all the archangels that have been with me all spirits spirit guides and protectors and ask that my energies return to more normal working levels amen once you've closed down you're done now this is something that i have done many times and it works it is amazing the difference that people could feel in a home. Um, and when the lines are just completely done, um, gone, they feel so much better. So here is something that is amazing. This is where a lot of this information is. This is a book that we use throughout my house healing program that I was in. Um, it's by Adrian Inkleden Weber. It has step-by-step -step everything you possibly need to know he does have a second book heal your home too everything is in one he adds on into so that's another great one to have um, there's so much information in there it everything that i do is is basically in there um, it is amazing so i would really suggest checking that out i've purchased them off amazon so that is what i do uh step by step uh it is really cool. It's something that anyone can do. You can do this today in your home. Check out the other video of how to find some of these lines. I'm going to do other videos on finding other elements of house healing. Um, but for now, hopefully this helps and let me know if you give it a try.